Chapter 6 More about Scratch 3.0 Learning Outcomes At the end of this chapter, students will be able to Know about different blocks in Scratch Change different backdrops in Scratch projects Warm up Label the Scratch window components Teachers note Assist the students in labeling the components of the Scratch window Motivate them to recall Scratch, which is a programming language that lets you create interactive stories, animation, games, music and art. Hello friends, in the previous class we learnt about creating, opening and saving Scratch. Now let's learn about the different blocks in Scratch. Scratch does not require any code for giving instructions to the computer. It uses blocks to perform a specific task. For using these blocks, all you have to do is to understand what these blocks can do for us. Blocks Palette A vertical strip located just beneath the code tab is described as a block palette. The block palette contains a total of 9 blocks. There are numerous sub-blocks available when we click on a specific block. Motion Block One of 10 categories of scratch blocks is motion blocks. There are medium blue in color and are used to direct a sprite's movement on stage. Follow the given steps to move a sprite using motion block. Steps 1. Click on the motion block button. Let me answer. Can you relate more with the character which shows movement? Step 2. The code palette will show a list of blocks that belong to motion block. Step 3. Click on the move 10 step blocks and drag this block to place it in the script area. Step 4. Now click on the turn 15 degrees block and place it just after the move 10 step block in the script area. Step 5. Run the code by clicking on the blocks in the script area. Lux block. Purple colored blocks are look blocks. They control a sprite's appearance including its costume and backdrop. Let me answer. Have you ever changed the costume of any ideal you worship or toy you have? Use the say hello for 2 second block to display the message with sprite on the screen. Use think hmm for 2 seconds to add a thinking cloud to the sprite. It will continue to appear until another speech or thinking block is activated or the stop button is pressed. Follow the given step to change the costume of a sprite. Steps 1. Click on choose a sprite button on bottom right side of the scratch. 2. Select Dani sprite to click on the costume tab. 3. From the list of costumes, select Dami B costume. 4. The sprite's costume will be changed. Pen block. The pen block are green in color. These blocks draw a trial as the sprite moves on the stage. Pen color can be changed. This block is present as an extension to a scratch 3.0. Follow the given steps to add pens to the block category. Steps 1. Click on the add extension button at the bottom left corner of the code tab. 2. Click on the pen option and it will be added to the code tab. Sounds block. Sound block are in pink color. They make animated lively by adding different sounds to a project. You can even record your voice and save it. Remember it. Block should be placed in order. Follow the given steps to add sound in a project. Step 1. Click the sound block. 2. Select the place sound meow until done and drag this block and place it under the script palette. 3. Run the code by clicking on the blocks in the script area. 4. To stop all sounds being played on all sprites, use the stop all sounds block. Events block. Events block is yellow in color and controls the event and the starting of the scripts. You can click on the sprite with a mouse or a keyboard to control it. The interaction with the sprite is called events. 
use when green flag clicked block to execute the attached block when the green flag is clicked when the space key press block executes the attached blocks when a keyboard key is pressed when the sprite clicked block the executes the attached block when the left mouse is clicked at the sprite control block control block is yellow in color and controls the flow of the script they provide functions for looping various blocks in scripts the most commonly used control blocks are the repeats block this block repeats a set of blocks for a given number of times the wait 1 seconds this block pauses the running of the script till the specified time the forever block this block keeps on repeating a set of blocks till the stop button is clicked changing the backdrop the stage backdrop is a term used to describe the backdrop to make our projects more exciting and engaging we can modify the stage backdrop by default the backdrop of a stage is white we can either make our backdrop or choose the backdrop available in the library below the stage area the backdrop option is present there are four different options for changing the backdrop of the stage they are choose a backdrop paint surprise upload backdrop follow the given steps to choose a backdrop for the stripe steps 1 click on the choose a backdrop button 2 choose a backdrop window appears 3 from the preview list select the blue sky backdrop the blue sky backdrop at the background of the sprite will be added get psycho your friend is creating a project in scratch she wants to create a new sprite in her project suggest to her the steps to do the same let's recall a vertical strip located just beneath the code tab is described as a block palette numerous sub blocks are available when we click on a specific block purple colored blocks are looks block Sound blocks can record your voice and save it. Motion blocks are used to direct a sprite's movement on stage. Backdrop is referred to as the background of the stage. Upskill your intelligence. A. Fill in the blanks. One. Scratch uses dash to perform a specific task. Answer. Blocks. Two. Block palette is a vertical strip located just beneath the dash tab. Answer: Gold. Three. Below the dash area, the backdrop option is present. Answer: Backdrop. Four. Purple colored blocks are dash blocks. Answer: Looks. Five. By default, the backdrop of the stage is. Answer: White. B write the function of these blocks 1 turn 15 degrees answer the default value of the turn block is 15 they will rotate your sprite 15 degrees in a clockwise direction as shown by the arrow on the block 2 think hmm for 2 second 2 use think hmm for 2 second to add a thinking cloud to the sprite Three. Repeat ten. Answer. This allows you to repeat a sequence of commands a particular number of times. You set the number of times the loop will repeat at the top of the block. C. Write T for true statements and F for false statements. One. Scratch requires code for giving instructions to the computer. Answer. False. Two. Control block controls the flow of the scripts answer true 3 the interaction with the sprite is called events answer true 4 pen color cannot be changed answer false 5 motion block is used to direct a sprite's movement on stage answer true d tick the correct option 1 Which of the following blocks are used to control the appearance of sprite? A. Control. B. Sound. 
C. Looks. D. Events. Answer C. Looks. 2. The term is referred to as the background of the stage. A. Canvas. B. Backdrop. C. Work area. D. Foreground. Answer B. Backdrop. 3. Color of look block is dash. A. Yellow. B. Pink. C. Green. D. Purple. Answer D. Purple. 4. The block controls the event and the starting of the scripts. A. Looks. B. Motion. C. Event. D. Pen. Answer C. Event. 5. Pink color is of dash block. A. Sound. B. Motion. C. Pen. D. Control. Answer A. Sound. E. Answer the following questions. 1. Write the use of motion blocks. Answer. The use of motion blocks are motion blocks are used to direct the sprite's movement on stage. 2. What is the use of pen block? Answer. The pen block present as an extension to the Scratch 3.0. 3. Name the different blocks available in Scratch. Answer. The different blocks available in Scratch are Sound Block, Motion Block, Control Block, Event Block and Pen Block. 4. How can we add music in Scratch? Answer. 1. Click the Sound Block. 2. Select the play sound meow until done and drag this block and place it under the script palette. 3. Run the code by clicking on the block in the script area. 4. To stop all sounds being played on all sprites, use the stop all sound block. 5. Write the step to change the background. Answer. Follow the given step to choose a backdrop for the sprite. Step 1. Click on the Choose a Backdrop button. 2. Choose a Backdrop window appears. 3. From the preview list, select the Blue Sky Backdrop. The Blue Sky Backdrop at the background of the sprite will be added. Critical Thinking A. John is creating a story with audio in Scratch. He notices that the audio is playing even after the story is over. Suggest to him the way which he should use to stop the audio. Answer. To stop all sound being played on all sprites, use the stop all sounds block. B. Search the name of the blocks in the grid given below. Answer. Sound. Control. Pen. Events. Looks. Motion. Team. Work. Work in pairs. Create this project in Scratch and enjoy it. Further, continue the conversation. Answer, students will do it themselves.